Well, I'm just sitting here waiting for this upload to finish onto YouTube. It is the first spray session of the Florida Exotic Cichlid series. Not all, so not all the exotics that are in Florida. Flo Let me just back up for a second. Florida has got, they're saturated, oversaturated even with so many fish that are not indigenous to the Everglades, to their, their water system. Um, but these species have taken hold with force and most of them are phenomenal game fish if you're fishing for them so i thought that it would make perfect sense to start a florida exotic session and while i'm waiting for this upload to finish on the first one i'm going to give you guys a little bit of insight as to what's going to happen in the next few months with our spray sessions on this channel and also some of the places that I get my reference books and reference material, please don't look at that. Um, we're in the process. <laughs> we're in the process of um, of cleaning that corner up. It's the corner that nobody ever sees. It's where Ketchco stock is kept and random other things. There's, you know, it's just it's a dirty corner and we need to clean it. We know. We're sorry. I'm sure you're gonna leave me comments about how awful that looks. Um, so yeah, I get sources from a lot of places. Uh, love getting things like this. When I was in Arkansas, this was invaluable. Texas and South Central, um, right up into the Ozarks. So I referred back to these things a lot. If you guys have space in your painting area and you are interested, there's tons of resources on Amazon. I'm super stoked because this just came into the mail yesterday afternoon. I didn't have a chance to look at it because I was at work. It came to my house. Um, most states put out books, pamphlets of various fish. Now, they may even have a, um, a saltwater, but in particular, this is going to be awesome resources for 2021 for small waters, for different types of series that I have in mind. I'm going to be working on a few things. So the locals only Blue Ridge series, I'm going to pull from this book a lot tons of stuff want to do an expanded aquarium series this year obviously small waters georgia locals only the florida exotic series so there's more than 12 there's way more than 12 um but i'm not doing some of the eels and some of the real plain plain jane except for this brown hoplo uh, i am going to be doing the brown hoplo uh, so we're going to rotate all of this stuff into spray sessions this year super excited about it Encyclopedia fishes, guys, go to resources. And if you if you don't want to have heavy books, cumbersome books, um, although there's just something about going through an actual hardbound book that's just super cool. Maybe I'm just a big nerd. I don't know. Um, but I love stuff like this. But find yourself some resources, whether it's online, whether it's in a book, or go to your local um, ranger stations. Most states have naturalist courses. Some of them are free. You can become a master naturalist and learn about the species that are indigenous to your area, your world. I'm in North Georgia, so that is just, I'm rediscovering how much I love the outdoors again. And I sound excited because I'm super pumped for this year. This is going to be a fabulous year, year for all of us. We're going to get through whatever crap is still residual from this pandemic and we are going to persevere and we are going to come out on top and you guys are going to be right there with us so we look forward to lots of cool content that seat over there mr mr bullshad um we're going to be doing a lot of stuff bringing his um channel into the mix a lot this year so stay tuned with us and we look forward to seeing you all throughout the year on this youtube channel and bullshad see ya